Hello everybody. Well, I uh, thought I'd uh, preface this next video with a, a short intro. Um, the video is actually one that I had uh, no intention of uploading. I had uh, filmed it last week. It's been on my mind for a long time, for many years, and I uh, was inspired last week during a hike to, uh, to, to try and film it, and I did, and I had uh, decided to not upload it because of uh, for a variety of reasons, uh, namely because of the recent events in Japan, and I thought that uh, there wasn't any need for any uh, videos that uh, that discussed the topic of death. That there had been enough of that, and so I I just let Reddit as, as, you know put it aside, and I also didn't want to upload it because I I thought that there was it would be too easy to misunderstand what I was trying to say in the video. Um, however, in uh, a series of other videos on this. On this channel, as well as on the Softy Papa channel, I've had uh, numerous comments from people that just hit so close to home with regards to the topic that I wanted to address in uh, this particular video. Uh, it was startling that uh, people were beginning to make comments that that my answer would be the video. Um, it happened uh, yesterday. It happened again today. It just was checking one out, and it was startling. The guy said the exact same thing that I want to say in the video. So um, anyway. Uh, the other point that I wanted to make was, uh, so I've decided I'm going to go ahead and upload the video. Uh, and please uh, understand that my respects to the country of Japan, to those who have suffered, to the people that have, are suffering. The uh, t topic of uh, death is is not one that I, I, I brought up easily at this time. I would, would prefer perhaps to wait uh, a couple of years or uh, maybe even never. But uh, the timing seems to be right and the interest seems, and there seems to be some interest there. The uh, second point that I wanted to point out was that um, the title. Uh, the title of this video is uh, my, my Death Wish, and um, I know that that's a loaded term, and I know that it uh, brings uh, up on images of, uh, of, of very dark images of uh, a possible suicide or, uh, or of uh, or just um, wanting, to, wanting to end it or not be a part of life anymore. And uh, it's not my intention at all. I didn't choose that title to uh, gain uh, views or subscribers or anything. The reason I went with that title, uh, I, I fought myself on that one, and I, and I usually don't don't give too much concern to the titles and everything like that. My videos are just little videos. That's all they are. They're nothing significant. But the reason I decided to go with it is because that title, My Death Wish, is precisely what this message is. This is exactly what I'm trying to say. If you eliminate the loaded elements of the of those terms um, and take away the connotations that they have from societal elements, um, that's exactly what I'm trying to say. I am sharing with you my death wish. Now, it doesn't mean it's a negative thing. I'm a very optimistic guy. I am a, I'm a happy man. I, uh, for the most part, I mean, I have my down days, just like anybody, but for the most part, I want to be around a long time. I don't have any death wish to die right away or anything like that, and I'm not dealing with any serious problems that I that are, want me to jump off a cliff in the woods. It's just that if I could work, if I could, you know, write up a script. I mean, look, give my dad an example. My dad had told me uh, prior to his his passing how he wanted to die in some simple broad strokes. You know, he didn't want to die in a hospital. He didn't want to be infirm. He didn't want to convalesce for a long time. And he certainly didn't want to uh, be in pain. Um, as a result, he, uh, uh, not as a result, but he did die the way he wanted to. He died fast, doing something he loved with the people, with two or three of the most important people in his life, and he went uh, at, uh, when he was still in his in, in, in his prime, in his prime in some capacities. And uh, I know he wished he could have stayed around a couple more decades. I'm sure he would have wanted to, but that's how he wanted to go. I'm basically trying to do the same thing. I, I don't. I'm not trying to foretell what's going to happen. I'm just trying to say that this is the preferred way to go, and for me, and for a number of reasons. And I don't. I don't want to cause. I, I probably will never go this way. Because I'll, I'll leave it to the video. I won't get any more details. This is this preamble has gone on long enough. But just take it to put this video in an optimistic light. This is just me talking about the, uh, the, the ideal way to to to, to go away when that time comes. Okay. Nothing too negative, and with the greatest respect for the uh, those who are suffering anywhere in the world. Okay, here's the video. Bye bye. Ooh. Hi everybody. I want to uh, share with you uh, something very personal, intensely personal. <clears throat> something I've uh, thought about making a video for for the longest time, but I've uh, I've uh, resisted it because I know that uh, people won't. Uh, um, understand, some people won't understand 
what I'm trying to say. I don't mean that in any, like it's like it's. It, I don't mean that. See, I've already started out difficult. I can't make this video because it can't. I I can't make it come out right. But I'm going to try anyway. I don't mean that you can't understand it in terms of um, understanding my words or the ideas. What I mean is that I, I don't think very many people share this like, this feeling, and that they won't get what I'm talking about, or they won't they won't have an, a sense of the uh, feeling that I, uh, that I want to convey. Because typically, when you're sharing ideas, you're oh crap. Hi crab, there's a crab right there, check it out. Hello crab, hello. That is a female. Yes, come here you. A, a female uh, a Japanese river crab. Ah, they're falling over. Go down to the river below, I'm sorry. I gave you such a hard time crab. Back to my topic. Death wish. I want to talk to you about my wish to die. See? <laughs> You're already thinking I'm talking like I want to off myself thinking that. I, that's not what I mean at all. <clears throat> Haven't you ever uh, considered uh, how you want to go, the method and manner of your demise? Um, <clears throat> maybe uh, a lot of people don't like to talk about it or think about it or anything. They just want to have it as some vague, obscure, uh, uh, um, not certainly not a potential, a vague, ob um, obscure uh, a certainty in the future that uh, they'll leave up to uh, faith in the gods and, uh, and whatever else is going on. To me, um, I have a particular manner and uh, desire for my uh, for my end, and uh, I want to talk about that now. And heck, if if it doesn't make any sense, and then what the heck? At least I'll I'll get it out. Sometimes you just need to get it out, you know. Especially if I ever if it ever comes about, if it ever comes about that I I do disappear in the wilderness, you know, suddenly one day. Uh, I sent out a tweet saying I'm heading off into the into the woods, uh, and then you guys never hear from me again. At least then you'll know um, my point of view on the thing. So let me get to it. Quit, quit beating around the bush, Softy, and just tell us what the heck, or Laws, brother. Whoa, don't fall over, and tell us what the heck you're trying to say. Hmm. I want to die out here. I uh, don't want to uh, end my days in a in a hospital, or even in my home, or in a, in a traffic accident, heaven forbid, you know, someone else might get hurt, or in any conventional manner. I certainly don't want to kill myself. I don't want to go in any of those ways. The way I want to go is I want to one day come out, and this has been a dream I've had since I was a boy. I want to one day uh, come out into a place like this, but not a place like this, because you'll see an evidence of humanity all about me. They'll find me. I want to be in the deep wilderness, the stuff that I love most, the places where nobody goes, the places where I am confident that I am uh, perhaps the very first person to ever uh, see some of these places. And in a place like that, I want to have an accident that incapacitates me such that uh, uh, I die. And nobody ever finds me. And then my body, uh, uh, you know, goes back into the woods. Now, this has been a dream since uh, I was a boy. Since I first started uh, realizing death and you know, began this love affair with nature, I, uh, I knew that I wanted to uh, end my days in a place like this. I don't want to end anytime soon. I want to go when, uh, when I've, uh, my body is, uh, is, is, is finished, when my time is finished, you know, um, and all that kind of stuff. Um, the, the reason I probably will never realize this one dream is because I made the decision in life to become a family man. You know, I've got a, a wife and daughter, not to mention my, my brother and my mother, and extended family and friends who, uh, who care about me, and, uh, I, and I care about them, and I want to be around. You know, I want to be around as, as long as I can to support and care for my family and, and to, be, um, to be a husband and a father and uh, a friend and to keep making videos. You know, I want to keep doing that as long as possible. But when the time comes, there'll be this, this critical thing. That'll, if, if, if I was not a family man, if I was not a family man, I would be taking far more risks. I would uh, be off into the mountains for days or weeks at a time and exploring uh, very uh, remote, strange places around the world, um, taking great chances, you know, exploring beneath the sea, um, uh, doing hitchhiking and maybe even again, like I used to, and which was dangerous. <laughs> All that stuff. With the understanding and the ambition of, uh, of meeting a... Uh, a uh, 
quiet Doma is in, in a green place and right? having nothing left to uh, bury, to worry about, or any of that. So there, I've made, I've made my case. Oh, look at the rain and the leaves. Look at that. Can you see that bamboo leaves floating in the wind? Wow. See, I mean, who would want to die there? Who, what better eulogy? Look at that. I don't know if it's coming through. Everywhere. Bamboo and other leaves falling all about. Look at that. Can you see them? Is it coming through? Look, here they come. And the wind. Sorry for the wind noise. What better eulogy can that be? I don't care about the rest. Sorry, if I, uh, I'll block the wind with my umbrella. I apologize if I go too soon and it, and it upsets. Hey, the rain's coming down and I go too soon and it, it, it's. And I'm gonna do not gonna do that. I'm gonna protect myself. I'm gonna care for myself for the sake of my family. But if it does happen, you can trust me that I will be careful out here. But if it does happen, if Softy one day disappears and never comes back, please send uh, send your regards to my family and don't give me another thought for the ever. Let me just be gone. Just forget about me completely and let it go. See you all. Bye-bye.